Deputies caught Manuel Vela last Saturday after a chase in East Bakersfield. He's being charged with the deaths of Katrina Rivera and her baby. Today, we're learning through newly released court documents. During the chase, investigators say Vela held the baby out of the window of the car and that he had been weaving through traffic, hitting multiple cars. The report also shows us during the chase, Vela also tried running over several California Highway Patrol officers. They attempted to strike a control train vehicle, correction, control three officer at about 35 miles an hour, accelerated towards them. When the chase ended, documents show Vela got out of the car with the baby boy in his arms, using him as a shield from deputies. They say Vela then dropped the baby, trying to make a run for it. Emergency crews tried saving the baby, taking him to a local hospital, but he was later pronounced dead. According to documents, when deputies opened Vela's car, they found his 30-year-old girlfriend, Katrina Rivera, dead inside. Katrina's family says she went missing Thursday. Vela says he killed her Friday. But how Vela describes what he did to both Rivera and her baby in these court documents is too disturbing for us to repeat. They involve graphic details and sexual assault. What we will tell you is Vela confesses to cutting the baby out of Rivera's womb after choking her to death.